Today's weather, weather really uh, comes down to just muggy, muggy and not that comfortable, even though it wasn't that hot, just, you know, just humid and sticky and we'd like to get this out of here, Ray. Yeah, if, if we didn't have the humidity in the air, uh, I think a lot of people would have complained about how cool it was today, but the air is just so juicy that uh, it, it just felt sort of nasty. And that's what we're going to be feeling the next couple of days, but we're going to be ramping up the heat with that. Right now, we have 70 degrees, light winds out of the west southwest, 90% relative humidity and a dew point at 67. So our dew points are way up there. There's a lot of moisture in the air and it does not look like this moisture wants to go anywhere this week. So uh, the humidity, that's sticking with us. Now, temperature wise, we're at 70 in Pittsburgh and Irwin and Blainsburg and Catanning, Newcastle, as well as Morgantown. Several upper 60s mixed in there, but Overall tonight, we're going down into the mid 60s spots like Greensburg and Latrobe at 66, 66 in Beaver, 65 Catanning, Pittsburgh likely stopping at about 68. So we're only going to lose a couple more degrees between now and tomorrow morning. And that gives us a warm starting point for tomorrow and our temperatures are going to jump up. We're going to get some incoming sunshine that's going to help warm us up. So that'll heat the ground, which will heat the air and help out with that humidity, making it feel extra nasty outside with temperatures in the 80s in most cases, but easily feeling like the 90s most everywhere tomorrow and high temperatures do touch the 90s by the time we get to Wednesday. Now there's a big thing happening here Wednesday night into Thursday. We're going to see some thunderstorms developing. This is going to be mainly a nighttime event Thursday or Wednesday night into Thursday morning. However, it will drop our temperatures a little bit, but to 85, that's still above average. And then we warm right back up with more humidity closer to the weekend. And just to show you the humidity, we're going to be living within the sticky to muggy range through much of this forecast. But we are going to see a couple of times where we try to dabble in extremely humid. So just know it is going to be a juicy week and that moisture in the air is available for rain and some thunderstorms to work with, but we need some triggering mechanisms. That's not going to happen tonight, but we could see some patchy areas of fog by early tomorrow morning. Then into the afternoon, we're going to clear it out. Uh, we have clear skies tomorrow night and early Wednesday. Most of Wednesday comes with those clear skies attached, but it's Wednesday evening. We start seeing a little activity up towards Akron and Cleveland. This is not looking to arrive to us until about 10 11 o'clock moving through through midnight and 1 a.m. and then into Thursday will dry it up and I think it looks a whole lot better heading closer to the weekend and most of the weekend looks to come in dry tonight though 68 mostly cloudy skies in spots clear in others and that's going to be an on and off thing for the rest of the night 88 tomorrow mostly sunny skies light winds out of the south and muggy conditions at least it's going to be one of those days with much brighter conditions attached in 82 by lunchtime then you will get those extra degrees into the afternoon 90 Wednesday only an isolated thunderstorm late the better chances Wednesday night into Thursday much warmer Friday and Saturday with mostly sunny skies Sunday we could see some thunderstorms developing especially during the afternoon still warm and humid at 87 and more storms into Monday and next week